Hey folks, welcome to another numeracy video. In this video, we're going to be looking at solving index form numbers. Um, so without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so one of the common mistakes that I see people doing uh, when I see these types of questions is that they see three to the power of four. And I don't know why, but they automatically go three times four. And then, then they write the answer as 12. Now remember, this is actually three to the power of four. This is not three times four. If they wanted you to calculate three times four, they would actually put it like this, three times four. But in this case, it is actually three to the power of four. So what that means is you're actually taking the number three and you're multiplying it by itself four times. So that means your answer here is gonna be three times three times three times another three. And that's gonna give you 81. Now, if you've been keeping up with my uh, video series, you know that you can actually do this in a much shorter way in this calculator. So all we need to do is we just go three uh, to the power of, which is this button here, click on three to the power of four, and we've got 81. Sometimes you might, you know, in the middle of the exam, you might be sitting there going, it's like, oh, I can't remember which button he was talking about. If that comes, if that happens to you, then what's the best way to do is with something like question B, you could just go two times two times two. And as you can see, I've written it three times there. Um, and that's because it's been, uh, it's to the power of three. And two times two times two times two is eight. Um, we should be comfortable with that. If you still wanna use the calculator, then you can go two to the power of three, which is going to get, um, get you eight. Now seven to the power of eight, again, just you can use the calculator straight away for this. Um, and I don't know, you know, it can get a bit tedious if you were to go seven times seven, like I'm already getting tired just doing three of them. Look okay, at what, four, five, and look at how much concentration I gotta have, six, seven, and eight. So I'm getting somewhere like 5,764, but let's actually do this real quickly. We're gonna go seven to the power of eight, and that's going to give me that same answer, which is uh, 5,764,801. Folks, that is basically just a quick little intro into solving uh, index form um, questions. All right, folks, that is basically it for this video. As always, don't forget to like this video, share this video, and subscribe to keep up with the latest content. Now, there should be a couple of playlists popping up here and here. Great material for revision. And as always, thank you for watching.